The Russian army has begun using the North Korean Bullseye 4 long-range self-propelled anti-tank missile system against Ukraine, according to Militani. The Bulsei 4 is capable of hitting a target beyond the line of sight, i.e. at a distance of more than 10 kilometers. There is no precise data on the characteristics of the North Korean weapons. However, according to some sources, the range of destruction is in the range of 10 to 25 kilometers, which allows for an attack from a safe distance. The launcher consists of a rotating module of eight containers with missiles. The guided missile is equipped with large stabilizers and a mode of attacking the target from above. To guide the missile, an electro-optical head is used on the missile in combination with command guidance via fiber optic cable. This allows the system operator to manually control the missile via video. During the missile's flight, he sees all the folds of the terrain and all the objects. He can bypass obstacles and hit the target beyond the line of sight or even behind cover. Militani reports, constant video contact allows the system operator to change the target for the missile to a higher priority. Vitali Sarantsev, the spokesperson for the operational tactical group Kharkiv, said that he could not confirm the information about the use of Bulsay 4 missile systems by Russia. At the moment, we do not record either the arrival of this equipment or any facts of its use, he emphasized. North Korea is actively supporting Russia in its war against Ukraine. For example, North Korea sent more than 1 million artillery shells to its partner. In addition, Russia has also used North Korean missiles in its shelling of Ukraine. Recently, Russia and North Korea signed a comprehensive strategic partnership agreement. This agreement may include, among other things, the possibility of sending North Korean troops to Ukraine as well as mutual assistance in the event of aggression against one of these countries. At least 123 people have been killed in massive landslides triggered by heavy rains in the southern Indian state of Kerala. Dozens of others are still feared to be trapped following the landslides. The landslides hit the Vainad district on early Tuesday with rescue teams dispatched in the area. According to Chief Minister Pinari Vijayan, the landslide has wiped out an entire area. The landslides have hit several areas in the district including Mandakai, Adamala, Koromala and Kunhom. Over 200 army personnel have also been deployed to help security forces in search and rescue efforts, according to official reports. Over 123 injured victims have been hospitalized and more than 3,000 people have been rescued and moved to 45 relief camps. The number of casualties are expected to be increased. Vainad, a hilly district which is part of the Western Ghats mountain range, is prone to landslides during the monsoon season.